All right, YouTube. I'm out here working on a Ford F-150. Uh, it's gonna be the 4x4 XLT 5.4 Triton. This is going to be the year 2007. Um, a little bit about what I'm doing today. I'm putting on some seat covers, as you can see. Um, and they look really nice. And now I'm trying to work on the back seat. You may need this back seat up for a variety of reasons, speakers, uh, seat covers, that's what I'm doing for today. Um, first things first, I'll make this video nice and short so you guys can get right to it. I know you guys don't want to hear me talk. Um, I had a lot of trouble with this. There's been people out there that say that it's not much trouble. It is if you have big hands. You need at least another person with you um, to help out. That helps out a lot. Um, I did it by myself. It's definitely feasible. Um, but it helps out big time if you have another person first things first you will be taking the headrest off headrests are completely off 2007 Ford F-150 um, headrest so these are gonna pop right onto there okay there's a little notch right here Maybe if I can come into it here so this one right here you will press that in and that other person will help you press this little notch in right here on the left side. Same thing on both. Here and here. Okay, so that is gonna that is going to be how you take the headrest off. Next thing you do here is you take this off. This seat belt holder, whatever you would call it. It'll pop right onto here. That's how it'll look. You will need a ten millimeter socket in your ratchet, obviously. Um there's only gonna be two two little bolts there. Okay, so that'll come down. Next thing you do for the seat. It is helpful if you have a person with very small hands. Um, this is a pain. I've been out here for at least an hour and a half and just now managed to uh, figure this out. So as you can see, the seatbelt thing is kind of up there somewhere. I got it out of the way because it kept bothering me, got stuck in my hand. So the way I did it was you lift, you lift the seat here and there's a really small notch you could get into here. That really small notch is where you're going to fit your hand, okay? You will maneuver your hand as best as possible. Um, the small handed person preferred stick their hands in. You pull the seat as far forward as you can. Um, I will show you what you're looking for in a second. So, like I said, you kind of lift that up there, put something here to hold it up. Um, and then that little crevice right there is where I initially got my hand in and then made my way up and at the same time pulled the seat as far forward as I could okay it's gonna be the same thing on the other side here so this side was a little bit more difficult but yeah do the same thing you lift the seat up there and there's gonna be a real fine small space there right there you fit your hand in there initially, and then you start making your way up as comfortable as humanly possible. And then after you do that, um, I'll show you kind of what you're going to be looking for there. Um, let me go ahead and remove this seat, and then I'll be back with you in a second here. 